I was asked to uh, talk about um, maybe the longer term effects of this um, of this year. What can we say about 2020? Uh, well, it's not over, and it's been a year that we will probably never forget. The technologist, to be super successful, needs to be a five-tool athlete. Um, that's right. That's um, right. And, well said. And it, that's well why said. the role is so much harder than it's ever been before. We take the mindset that, that none of us have all the answers and whether it's somebody who's just joined our team right out of college or somebody like me who's been in this field for 36 years, everybody gets the chance to have their say and we listen to what everybody brings to the table. Being better for each other and our world, we are better conscious creators and really there is nothing better than that. I always think you should build for the future and always just find a little bit of time at the end of the day to live in the present. If you get stuck in the present, you're gonna wake up one day and there's no future. We really needed to do this faster in order to support the Moon to Mars mission, which is called the Artemis program, named after Apollo's twin sister, um, because that program, the Moon um, 2024, is to put the first American female on the Moon and put another man back on the Moon. How do we take what we've learned? How do we take what we're seeing now and start building the foundations for the future? You know, don't waste a crisis. It's a terrific opportunity to create something new.